compassionate name. It's a very compassionate name. So meaning I love to give freely from my heart to the people. So it's a compassionate name generally. Although it is long in explanation, but generally it just summarizes it all. Yeah. Okay, thank you uh, so much. Uh, maybe before we have one of your songs that is I'm Alive, uh, I just uh, wanted to know from you, how did it feel like coming to Arua? Just, uh, for <laughs> how did it feel from Zombo to Arua? Uh, what was the feeling that you had in your mind? Wow, 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 wow. That's an amazing question. You know, for 26 years now, I've been in West Nile, but I've been going to other districts, other places, but I had never come to Arua. I was wondering why. But one thing spoke in me, that the first time you'll be going to Arua, you'll be going for the ministry. And mm. this is the opening. So I really feel so, so blessed to be in our city, the city of West Nile. I'm just so blessed. I don't even know I what know, to say. I know you feel alive. Like yeah, I feel alive. alive. <laughs> Amen. I, I, you know, as if I was really dead, not actually being here in our city. But now I feel so amazed and, and full and alive as you can see me here. Okay, let's, let's have your song then I'll be right back after this musical piece. Oh. You know, I, I came far away. I started with the world. <coughs> I started with the secular music. Mm -hmm. I did some like an album. Then after that, you know, it has been so, so hard producing those songs but when I came to the gospel ministry God showed me that he wanted me in the gospel mm. so he made a way he opened up ways okay. in only two months okay. he had already given me like two albums <coughs> now if you are saying <laughs> if you are saying then meaning <laughs> meaning that God did something amazing yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I just know uh, because it's uh, amazing uh, I just wanted to know uh, how easy did you cope up from coming from the secular world to uh, gospel music? What prompted you to come? And how did you uh, cope up with uh, uh, the change? Yeah, you know, um, being in the world is something that is so painful to people who are still there. Um, when I was in there, I suffered so much. I thought I was doing something right when I was just destroying my own life. So it was so, so hard there. There have been challenges that you have been facing uh, throughout this. Yes, of course. You know, these uh, secular friends, you know, they have, they, have, they have always been, you know, lifting me so high, saying, go on, rise on, you see, if you were still this side, you know, you would have been the other side, you would have got this, this and that. You know, that's actually one challenge. Temptation okay. is one of the biggest challenge. Actually, they are still following me up to now, mm -hmm. but I say I'm, I'm no longer there. Yeah. I'm for Christ Jesus. Amen. Yeah. Okay. Is actually yeah. Uh, thank you uh, so much. Uh, the day, uh, Zombo District. Uh, Zombo District. Uh,